Hey, what's up? It's Katie Bing, and welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I hope you enjoy your stay, and if you're not, thank you so much for being a part of my family. I appreciate you guys so much, and I'm so excited to be back, so let's get straight into the video. Okay, today's video is going to be a meeting all my dogs video, and I usually like to do them in the order that I got them, but I guess we're going to go backwards, so we're going to start with the newest, and then we're going... Hi, buddy. You're falling. Okay. This is 12 week old Gumbo, and his name is Gumbo. I was looking on Instagram or Google or something with my boyfriend, and we were like, hmm, what would be a funny name for a dog? Gumbo. Because I am a dog trainer and run a dog daycare, so I have a lot of dogs around me at pretty much all times, so we didn't want a name that anyone else had. And so we came up with the name Gumbo. He is the most fearless dog I've ever met. He's absolutely unfazed by everything. He loves water. He's going to be such a fun dog. He's going to be a great sport dog. We are just going to have to decide what we exactly want to do with him. We took him to the vet for the first time and he did amazing. He just is a little quick, a little mouthy, and yeah, we're working on normal puppy stuff with him, but he's doing great with his tricks so far. He's a really, really good dog overall. Remember, take notes of all the dogs, because I'm going to have you comment down below which dog is your favorite and which one you'd most likely want to own. So, remember all the dogs. This is Kobu, and Kobu is a five-month-old Australian Shepherd puppy, and I swear he was sent to me by Oxer. <laughs> He is the sweetest, sweetest, most calm dog. I love him so much. He is such a good boy. He is scared of everything and has anxiety, bad separation anxiety, and is a little possessive, so we're working through all of that. So we've definitely had to spend a lot of time working on our behavior, so we grew up to be a good pup. But overall, he is like the nicest dog. He cuddles with us. Ray, you cuddle with us. And he's just such a sweetheart. He's so chill for his age. And we definitely have to do a lot of confidence building with him. But besides that, Kobu is the greatest pup. How do you? This is Takito. Takito is a 11 year old um, Chihuahua Dachshund Terrier mix. And he has 1% St. Bernard in him. So he's a St. Bernard mix, for, if you ask me. He's a great dog. He's like the biggest jerk and the biggest sweetheart all in one. Sometimes he tries to bite your hand off if you get something and steals it. He's a scavenger. And other times he's cuddled up in bed with you. He's just, he has two different personalities in his little body. For how small he is, he doesn't lack personality. And he is just the biggest goober. goober. And we definitely get a lot of joy from having a taquito in our lives. I could not imagine my life without him. Because he is just so fun. and. Yeah, he's a good, good dog. Right, Takito, you're a good, good dog. And he does stuff, like, he hangs out on the kitchen table, which none of our other dogs would be allowed to do. Like, they would get in so much trouble. But he has no rules, because he's Takito. So, this is my personal favorite dog. His name is Rain, and he's just a great dog. He is a Russian basset hound, and he's cool. You're cool, Rain. You're the best dog, huh? I'm the best dog. My name is Rain. This is Cider. He is my most awkward dog. He is a Chow Coyote mix, so he's not totally a dog. He is the sweetest dog I own and the most innocent by far. He sheds a ton because of the Chow. And we actually got him in 2015. We were looking on Facebook, or I was looking on Facebook. And he came up and he reminded me of like Oxer's look when he gets sad. And he had gotten into altercations with a couple of people at the pound. And they had to put his mom down. And so he was just so sad when he got caught, he was feral, that he just shut down and didn't want to have anything to do with anyone. So I rescued him. He lived in my backyard for two months. And finally, we rehabilitated him to the point where he came inside. And now he is socially awkward and takes about three months to warm up to people. But he's still the sweetest, goofiest dog, and because he plays hard to get, everyone wants him to love them. This is Indy. She is my year-old Doberman Pinscher. She is such a great puppy, and she was, I would say, like my heartbreak dog. I went through a breakup, got sad, got a dog, and it was the best decision of my life. 
That said, do not impulse buy dogs. Down. Good girl, mamas. Because they are a lot of work, but thankfully I have a team of girls that help me every day because I am a dog trainer. Let's do a count of how many times I said I'm a dog trainer. Let's start that in this video. And she is the funniest Doberman ever. I feel like most of the Dobermans I meet are serious, they're high strung, and she's just not. She is, they told me she was super high energy, and I got her, and I was like, she's low energy. We do eight miles a day, and she's dead tired. She can't keep up. So yeah, she does about four to eight miles a day, depending on the day. She loves it. She's very bad at fresh and frizzy, but she enjoys playing them. She has an obsession with the neighbor's dogs. She is completely e-collar trained, off-leash trained. She runs by the bike off-leash. She's great. She's amazing, huh? She still has her puppy in her. She was technically supposed to be a show dog, but I decided not to show her. Life got crazy, COVID happened. And yeah, she's just now a working dog. She does a lot of my training sessions with me. She helps me rehabilitate a lot of dogs because she's bomb proof. She listens amazing. She's so good at not reacting to the reactive dogs. She's just perfect. And she takes naps on kitchen tables. See, like she just chills. No matter where we're at, she's always chill. You're just chill. You're chill, girl. Gazzy. I tried to move the camera a little bit lower so we could see her. She is the prettiest girl. She's 10 years old. She's a Doberman Pinscher. And she's the reason I got into dog training because she started attacking my rescue dog. So she got me all into dog training, but she's very great. She's high anxiety, but other than that, she's a very good girl. She definitely needs her bike ride and walk in the morning. And after her bike ride and walk, she's super chill for the rest of the day. She's probably the best sprinter I've ever seen, but also the best napper I've ever seen. So she's a diverse girl. She does it all with you. She's food obsessed. She will eat a whole bag of dog food if you let her. She eats all raw, and she doesn't think it's enough. Huh. You think you need more food, don't you, girl? But yeah, she's just the best dog. Hey, guys. It's K-Swizzle and M-Swizzle here. My name is Major. Okay, Major, describe yourself in two words. Gracious. <laughs> <laughs> and what? And stout. Okay, I would probably use the second one. Anyways, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching the video. My outro got deleted, so sorry about that. But now you get this one, and it's fun. I love you guys so much. Please make sure to like and subscribe to join our family. And I will see you next video. Bye!